Today, Mayor Tommy Battle started a series of meetings to discuss policing with protesters and community activists. Way 31's Grace Campbell spent the day at City Hall working to learn what comes next in this process. A spokeswoman with the city confirmed the mayor does have meetings scheduled, but she didn't tell me when they are or who they are with. So I reached out to three groups organizing Friday night's protest, and they told me this was the first they were hearing about any meetings with the mayor. But the leader of the Black Lives Matter in Huntsville told me it doesn't matter that he wasn't aware of any meetings. He's just glad that some like-minded groups are meeting with the mayor. The work is going to get done by one of our counterparts that you don't think is is working with us and it makes it easier it makes it so they can they can flu we'll we'll take the flag so that you can fluidly move and do what we need done starting friday huntsville mayor tommy battle is meeting with protesters and community activists to talk about policing and how we can become a united community keith young is the leader of the black lives matter group in huntsville he said since the city is growing, it's good to hear that Mayor Battle is working to have it grow together instead of apart. It'll be way too late to start making changes five years from now when all the problems that come with a big city are here. If we don't start working on them now, we're going to have massive issues then. And uh, I, 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 like I said, I can just applaud him for seeing that. Thursday night, the Huntsville Police Citizens Advisory Council released its reports following summer protests. Young says the findings are fueling his fire to stand up for what's right. This has spurred us on, amongst a lot of other things that are going on in the country, to uh, keep going and go a lot harder um, to be seen, to be heard, and to fight for, for justice, not only for the people who um, aren't, aren't here anymore, whose voices got stolen from them, but the, the, the generations yet to come. Young says the main thing he wants to see moving forward is transparency from the police. Reporting in Huntsville, Grace Campbell, Way 31 News. Thank you, Grace. The mayor's office told us these meetings are just one of many actions moving forward. As we've shown you, we have multiple reporters covering tonight's protests. We're going to stay on top of the story and bring you live updates as they happen.